Some children with a form of leukaemia have become the first in the UK to receive a new type of treatment, which is far less toxic than chemotherapy. As well as being much gentler on the body, the drug is able to be administered at home. Our reporter Michelle Roberts has been to meet one family who is benefiting. Life's getting back to normal for 11-year-old Arthur. He's been clear of cancer for almost a year now. He was one of the first children in the UK to try out a new type of cancer drug. Blina Tumamab or Blina can replace big chunks of aggressive chemotherapy. The news came that actually there was still some residual cancer, so that particular chemo phase had not, had not worked as, as expected. For Arthur, Blina was then the only real option to tackle his blood cancer. You can see the, the, the pick line that goes into his pyjamas and, and actually uh, there on the right hand side, the pump that was separately at that, at that point or so not yet in the backpack so everything could be... All of the kit can be carried in a small bag. Although he had to wear it day and night, it gave him back his freedom. Doctors say it's a much kinder alternative. Hello, Arthur. Come on in. Hello. And could be a game changer for kids with B cell acute lymphoblastic leukemia who struggle on chemo. Chemotherapy are poisons that kill the leukemic cells, but also kill and damage normal cells, and that is what causes their side effects. Gliantumab is a gentler, kinder treatment that doesn't have the same side effects as chemotherapy, but can cure just as many patients as chemotherapy. Inside all of us lurks a serial killer. That's our body's own immune cells. Blina helps them seek out and destroy the cancer. This death hunt is precisely targeted. Healthy cells are untouched. Each bead represents a specific thing. For example, that bead represents chemo. That it's been a long, tough journey for the whole family, made somewhat easier by Blina. I didn't have to, like, always be attached to, like, a machine. It made it feel, like, a lot freer. It also freed up some of Mum and Dad's time and they could finally do work again instead of having to go to hospital with me. Mm -hmm. New Year was when we found out that the Blina had worked and that there was no residual cancer, and so that was just amazing, and, and so we had double celebrations there. Blina's already used in adults, but it's not yet widely available on the NHS for children. Given its promise as a kinder, gentler treatment, Arthur's medical team hope it could be in the future. Michelle Roberts, BBC News.